everyone, it's Amanda. Today I wanted to film my makeup collection video. Now for a while I was thinking I was gonna wait to do this video, but then I kind of decided it's like a way for me to see how my collection has grown because in a couple months when I wanna film another one, I can look back at this and you know see what new products I've gotten. So for the sake of an, like a short intro and everything, I'm not gonna be in the video today. But um, I just wanted to let you guys know that this room is not my bedroom. It's just for like my makeup and um, my office kind of. So if you ever want a tour of this room, I'll do that. So to get started, my makeup table is from Target and it was around $30. I put it together on my own. It was really easy. It's just a nice white color. And I usually have a chair in front of it, but I just moved it out of the way. So over on the right side, I have my makeup mirror. It's by the brand Jordan. It has different light settings, um, it actually has a little outlet too, which is nice. I can, you know, like plug in my hair tool and do my hair with it. And um, it has three different mirrors. In the middle I have a placemat from Target, just to keep my desk clean, um, so I make sure no makeup gets on top of it. Right here in the center of my desk, I have kind of like my everyday makeup in this container that's from Ulta. And over here first, I have a Sigma Kabuki brush, and then I have my tweezers from Bath & Body Works. Um, right here I have two mascaras that are currently my favorite. I have the Falsies, and then the Mega Plush. Also, I'm really trying to keep this camera steady, so I'm sorry if it's kind of shaky. Um, right here in the center I have four of my favorite MAC lipsticks, and then I have my liquid foundation from CoverGirl, and my Rimmel um, Stay Matte Powder. This side I have my MAC Concealer, um, an Urban Decay eyeliner pencil, a Clinique eyeliner pencil, and another um, MAC one. And then right here I have my Carbon Black Mascara and my L'Oreal Liquid Eyeliner. Right there I just have an EOS Lip Balm a um, hand sanitizer, and then a hand lotion from Bath & Body Works. This clear container right here I just got recently from Amazon.com, and I'll link it down below if you want to check it out. I think it was about $14, so it was really good. Um, the quality is nice, and I'm actually going to go back and buy a couple more. I just use it to like kind of display some of my favorite products. So on the top I have my favorite blushes, and um, those include a NARS blush in Deep Throat, two Benefit Box Powders, three NYX blushes, and then a Tarte blush. The second drawer has eye bases and cream eyeshadows. I have the Urban Decay Primer Potion and then like a mini sample size of that. I have some NYX cream um, jumbo pencils, an Urban Decay cream eyeshadow, and then a um, Wet n Wild one. I also have two MAC paint pots. I have Painterly and Vintage Selection. I have a Benefit Creaseless Cream Eyeshadow, a MAC Cream Eyeshadow from their Electric Cool um, collection, and then I have an Essence of Beauty Stay All Day Cream Eyeshadow. The third drawer down is just my favorite lip products. I have a Revlon Just Bitten Balm Stain, a NYX lip gloss, an Urban Decay one, and then my favorite MAC lip gloss in the back which is um, Partial to Pink. I have a NARS lip gloss in Turkish Delight, one of my favorite Smashbox lip glosses, three more NYX, and then I have four um, Tarte Lip Surgeons pencils. On top of that container, I have a little box that I got from Target. It's really cute, and inside there I just hold my most used palettes. I have an eyelash curler in there from e.l.f. I have the original um, Urban Decay Naked palette, the second Urban Decay Naked palette, and then I have my MAC eyeshadow palette which I can show you inside there really quickly. I just have two more spots that I need to fill up. And if you guys ever want um, a video of swatches and names of all the shadows I have from MAC, I can do that. So going to the left side of my makeup table, I have a storage unit I got for Christmas two years ago. I got mine off of Amazon, but I'm pretty sure you can find these various places. On top of it, I just have a pretty lamp that I got from Target. I have my brush holders which I made just using filler beads and then glass containers. My brushes are all from either Sigma, MAC, and then I have one Sonia Kashuk brush I think. Right here are just kind of essential products. I have my Clean and Clear moisturizer and then two Evian facial sprays which I personally use kind of as a makeup setting spray and a refresher throughout the day. 
I have the brush that came with the Urban Decay Naked 2 palette. And then I just have a random um, sponge applicator that I used for my cream eyeshadow. Now the first drawer that I have in my storage unit is just for face products. Right here in the back I have um, my MAC blushes. So I just have five of those. And then over on this container, I have some drugstore blushes, like this L'Oreal one. I have a Maybelline um, mousse blush. And then I have a couple different bronzers. I have a Tarte one, NYC, and Maybelline. This container is kind of um, some like foundations. I have my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish and Light Plus. I have a Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer. A Benefit That Gal Face Primer. A Rimmel Face Primer a Maybelline concealer, and then two different shades in the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation. This section I have some more face powders. I have the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind, a Revlon Loose Powder one, and the Maybelline Fit Me. Right here is just a Physician's Formula Happy Booster Powder. I use this as a highlight sometimes. And then this front container, I have my everyday highlight, which is MAC's Mineralized Skin Finish in Soft and Gentle. I have a MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Semi-Precious Rose Quartz. And then a Femi Couture Highlighter, which is from Sally's. So in the second container, I have eye products. Now in the back, I just have random palettes. I have a Maybelline palette. Um, my favorite drugstore palette, which is by CoverGirl. A NARS palette in Silk Road, and then a MAC Quad. And then right here next to them are just Revlon um, cream shadows. Right here I have the Too Faced Naked Eye palette, and then next to it um, there is a random NYX trio, and then I have an extra pad for my eyelash curler, and then a random little brush. The first container is eyeliners. I also have my um, pencil sharpener, but I have a gel eyeliner by Wet n Wild, a couple Wet n Wild eyeliners, a NYX one, um, a Revlon one, just random drugstore ones. In this container I have my other mascaras. I have Benefits They're Real, which is one of my favorites, a couple Maybelline, L'Oreal, another Benefit, I have a Cargo. Just a couple random ones, like a Clinique one. In this last section, I have some more random products. I have a drugstore palette by Wet n Wild, a MAC eyeshadow, Victoria's Secret, Benefits High Beam and a little sample, an Essence of Beauty eyeshadow, a NYX one, and then another um, Wet n Wild shadow. This is just like a little single. Now in the last drawer that actually holds makeup, I have lip products. Now I have a random EOS hand cream, um, I don't know why it's in here, but and then I have two lip balms. Over on this side I have a MAC lipstick, Revlon ones, Rimmel, and then I have four L'Oreal hip jelly balms. This container I have lip glosses, I have some Rimmel, I have Artistry, I have Stila, MAC lip glosses, I have a couple of those. I have more Smashbox, Revlon, Essence of Beauty, some jelly tubes, um, another NARS one is in here somewhere, and I don't know, just random colors. This next drawer I just have empty products. I have two for Back to Mac and then just an empty Avion facial spray. This one is really random. I just have extra storage containers in there. And then this bottom one, I have some um, school stuff. And then this little makeup kit right here, this is my brother's girlfriend's makeup. So that was my whole makeup collection as it is right now. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll talk to you soon.